Hello, welcome back to our quick tip videos. My name is Jordan Steyer and this is Paul Volchek, Account Executives with the Partners Group. We've reached out to our national resources and evaluated business internally to bring you the updates of the 2015 and 2016 State of the Insurance Marketplace. Well, I think the theme today is great news. Going back to quarter three and quarter four of 2014, we've continued to see that downward spiral in insurance rates and premium, typically in the double digit percentage range, that 10 to 15% rate range. In quarter one and quarter two of 2015, we saw extremely high M&A activity in the insurance industry. What that's led to is a broadening of products and services as well as coverage terms and conditions available in the marketplace. That's continued to help keep rates low across the board. If we focus our attention on carriers that operate in niche business, niches like nonprofit, entertainment, hospitality, and biotech, we've actually seen a rate uptick, somewhere in that five to 10% rate range, and we believe it's simply because brokers aren't shopping the business. So what does that mean for quarter four of 2015? Carriers are extremely aggressive right now wanting to put up big numbers for year end. That means it's a very good time to market your account. Looking into 2016, we don't expect anything to change in terms of capacity in the liability marketplace. You will continue to see very aggressive rates offered. Regarding the property line of coverage, we've seen historical lows the last two years. What that means is that there's no place to go but up. You can anticipate flat renewals or slight increases in your property renewals this upcoming year. The DIC marketplace is very interesting. Investors are looking to get returns on their dollars somewhere other than the stock marketplace. The DIC marketplace is where they're looking to do that. What that means is that if you have a grade A facility that's been retrofitted, you can anticipate very aggressive rates moving forward. If you don't have a newer building or a retrofitted property, you can anticipate property rates going up with less capacity being offered. We want to leave you with two takeaways on the information we've just presented. One, you should be in the marketplace. Work with your broker on a strategy to capitalize on the rate savings that are available right now. Number two, get creative. Property rates are at an all-time low. They can only go up, so work with your broker and the carrier to negotiate two or three-year rate locks to continue to, to capitalize on that rate savings that's available right now. Thank you for your time, and we look forward to seeing you during our next Quick Tip video.